okay so you can um, make your pinhole in this little piece of metal that we've gotten off a conveniently redundant floppy disk that we found lying around the house here yeah, we've got a little um, needle a pin which I've put through a bit of cork just to give it a bit of sturdiness and now I'm going to just put a tap with a hammer Sand there. Sanding down with a fine sandpaper apparently gives it the whole more even edges. The sandpaper just helps do that. Now, I think that's about right. There. As you can see, there's a Tiny hole. Okay, here we have your Commodore Garden Polaroid pack film camera. You can usually pick them up um, in garage sales or opportunity shops or even on eBay for quite reasonable prices. Look for one that's got the tripod mount on it. Inside the camera, there are three screws you need to remove. Bring down the battery holders and you'll see the three screws at about 12 o'clock, 4 o'clock and 8 o'clock respectively. Now once you've removed the three screws from the inside of the camera, the front comes off like so. Giving you the basis for which to make your Polaroid pinhole. Now the uh, pinhole plate that I've made for the purpose of this, my first pinhole Polaroid is a bit too small for that aperture so I'm going to have to make something else to, to just mask around that big hole. Now that's where another piece of used Polaroid equipment comes in handy. This is just the pack that your pack film comes in. So you can just pull this apart and uh, there you go. Beautiful. And I just use tin snips to cut out the shape I need to cover the front of the camera. So then you turn it over and mark the inside of the square. Here's one I prepared earlier. It's a thing of beauty. Um, so you can see where I've cut the hole to attach my pinhole. I've just got to get that sort of central, make sure I've got the 
actual pinhole in place. You can use masking tape over the front of your pinhole aperture um, and remove it when you want to expose the film to light. Cover it over with the masking tape again when you have finished your exposure time. I've made a little bit of a sliding device to expose the pinhole to light, um, but I haven't actually gone into it here because it'll take too long. You ready? Mm -hmm. Okay. Starting now, so stay still for me. Three, two, one. Last off. Last off. It's a time move. Yep. Woo! Now plus my shoes, right? All the film. Now let me come down. It worked. It worked. Yeah, but Ta -da. you can't see my face from me because um, it looks like I don't have a... Uh, <laughs> a little looks, bit blurry. It looks a I bit don't weird. have a nose, I don't have eyes, I don't oh, have a mouth. No. <laughs> but it worked. Yay! Yeah, yeah. Let's see, let's see.